again, guys. I am back for one more video, completely unexpected, uh, but that is because it is almost December. We got, what, two more days till December, and it is currently 50 degrees outside, which is not bad at all. I almost don't need this jacket. Um, so I decided to come to one of the local parks again and see what I could find, uh, hopefully find some cool stuff today, because it may be one of the very last times I get to do this. I thought for sure the last hunt would be it, because uh, man, that was cold, but this is not bad at all. This is actually really pleasant. So I'm gonna spend the day, maybe three, four hours out here, try to find some cool stuff, at least before the snow hits. All right, let's get going. Okay, just found this. Just popped up right there, and I think you can see what it is right away. Pretty far down. It is a key. But what kind of key? That is the question. The soil is amazingly easy to dig right now because it's just been so wet lately. Oh, this is nice. That's a cool looking key. Anything on the back? <clears throat> I'll have to clean this up a little bit and uh, I'll show you what I found. Well, here it is, 905. There's no real markings on it as to tell me where it's from, but that is old. And I really like the pattern on this key. That is a cool looking key. Neat find. Well, this was cool. It was coming up as a coin, but looks like it's the trunk to an old toy car. I'm gonna keep looking in this hole and see if the actual car is there, but right now I think it's just the trunk or the hood. Okay, right down in this hole, I found a pretty big hit. It looks like, from what I can tell, it's an old jello jar. At least that's what I think it is. It looks like the jar actually might have been intact and I might have broken it when I was digging in here because I keep finding these little pieces of glass. A whole bunch of them over here. Kind of interesting. Well, I got excited at this one when it first started to pop out. I can think you can see why. But it looks like it's just some kind of I mean, it's heavy, it's it's aluminum, but it's really thick aluminum. I'm not sure what that is. That one got me going for a second there, though. Strange. There it is. And... Can slaw. Oh well. Okay, just dug this plug, and right at the top here I got something. I'm not exactly sure what this is. So we're gonna find out together. Hmm. Not sure at all what that is. <laughs> Interesting. It's very light. Got a really strong coin hit here up in the quarter range. So we'll try to do a live dig on it. Pretty far down. Okay, there it is. Yep. I can see it. And it's... Yep. <laughs> Strange. I thought it was actually a uh, cap to a can, but it's 
starting to think twice about that. I'm not sure what this is. It might be an old can cap, but not like one I've seen before. Strange. Hmm, interesting. I know what this is, it just popped up. I've gotten a couple of these in the past. All right here. And that is the bottom to a Matchbox car. What do we got? Matchbox for sure. Can't really read what it says. So we can zoom in a little bit here. Made in England, 1972. So maybe it's not a matchbox. No, it's a matchbox. Super fast, whoosh and push. <laughs> Very cool. Nice. Okay, right next to this old tree stump, a couple inches down, we got this guy right here, and I'm thinking that's a spoon. I guess we'll find out together here, but it sure looks like it. Yep, that's a spoon. What do we got? Is it silver? Mm -hmm. Let me clean it up a little bit and I'll let you know. All right, so here's what we have. Nobility plate, four crowns. And I looked this up and it was made by Oneida and it's quadruple silver plated. So silver, just not fully silver. <laughs> but that's kind of cool. Silver spoon, nice. Penny right there. I found the spoon right here, and now right here, I just had this pop up. Let me see it right here. It's promising. It's a necklace. What do we have here? Is that a ring? Because it's looking like it. Ooh, this is good. All right, I'm gonna clean it up and see what we have. Um, first off, I don't know if this is silver or not. I mean, it, it might be silver plated, but I just can't tell. It's too, there's just too much on it. And I, did, I didn't bring my brush to brush it off, so I'll have to clean that up when I get home. It, it could be silver, but I don't know. It's not cleaning up like silver normally does. It is in certain areas, but not, the, not everywhere. It does say best friends forever, and it was on a little chain, but that just completely fell apart. I don't really care about that anyways, because it was just a cheap little chain. But that's kind of cool. And then right next to it in the hole is, let's count them here. One, two, three, four, five screws. And they look like they're stainless steel screws. <laughs> Strange. Very odd to have just five sitting next to each other. Weird hole, for sure. Okay, this is the park that I'm at. And I think this area up here, I really wasn't getting anything. It's, it's relatively new, there's almost nothing. But this area back here, uh, there's the tree stump. I don't, you can't even see it. Uh, that I was finding all that great stuff like the spoon and the, and the little medallion. Uh, but I think this area is definitely a lot older because I'm getting a lot of stuff that is back from the 70s, 60s. Um, there's a little wa walkway here to get into the park and right here, I got something. And I don't know what it is. We're going to find out together. But it definitely looks different than most coins. I think it's a quarter. But let's take a look together. And 
yeah, that is a quarter from 1991. Look at that color to that thing, man. That's crazy. Looks like all of the plating has come off that, and it's just pretty much pure copper now. Huh. Thought I had something there. That's a weird looking, weird looking coin for sure. Oh well, on to the next one. Okay, right off this path here, got a good signal. Bouncing between gold and silver. That's pretty strong. Let's take a look, we'll do a little live dig. See what we get. I actually see something. Oh, you guys see that? Oh, this is promising. That is just under the surface. Is that a ring? That's an earring. if it's silver or not. Ooh, 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 hold on. I think that says 925. Nah. <laughs> Getting excited. And those could be diamonds. All right, nice. And I'm pretty sure that says 925. In fact, yep, it does. Amazing, there you go. It has been a silver day. Super happy about that. All right, I'm wrapping up for the day. It's getting a little cold out. Sun's starting to go down. Found this little guy on the way back to the car. <laughs> it's pretty old. It's an old Vaseline bottle. I don't see a date on it, but that's Clearly pretty old. It's kind of cool. I'll keep that. Probably look pretty neat once I clean it up. Well, this is funny. I couldn't find what was in this hole, and I almost covered it up and thought it was a phantom signal. And then I looked right to my left. And look at that, stuck to my shovel. And what in the heck is this? might be an old makeup case. Does it say Leon? Hold on. Lion? Luxon. I'll have to open this up and See what's inside. All right, let's take a look and see what we came up with today. Lots of loose change, uh, nothing to write home about, except for that quarter, which I thought was pretty cool. Um, screws and nails, including that group of five that I found all in a row, which is kind of strange. Matchbox car, the little uh, case, I'm gonna try to open that up, <clears throat> the makeup case when I get home. The Vaseline, really cool old key. This is a button, I think it's just aluminum. Uh, this aluminum piece. I uh, found this. I'm not entirely sure what that is. Looks like copper of some kind. Um, 
the hood to the toy car. And then the three good things, we got the silver plated spoon, the what probably is silver plated friendship necklace, and then the find of the day, what made it all worth it. And I think this just got dropped. It has, I mean, it's almost in perfect condition and it was barely underground. So somebody must've been walking through the park and it fell off, um, which is weird because it's actually closed. So that's odd. Um, yeah, the diamond, possibly diamond and uh, stained, sorry, sterling silver earring. Super, super happy about that. So once again, this will likely do it for this year. I want to say thank you again to everybody for liking and subscribing to the channel. Uh, it's going to get snowy next week, uh, pretty much guaranteed. And so this is probably going to be it for the year. Maybe we'll get some more warm weather. Who knows? I really hope so. And I can keep making some videos. But until then, until next year, thanks guys for watching. Have a great one. Keep digging.